The Federal Reserve had the larger economy, not just the stock market in mind, when it issued a surprise interest rate cut. But Wall Street was clearly paying attention. Minutes after trading opened on the New York Stock Exchange, the sell orders that had piled up during the worldwide slide over the holiday weekend pushed the Dow Jones Industrial Average down 465 points. But the three-quarter percent cut, the Fed's largest since 1991, took hold as the Dow trimmed its losses. Still, market watchers say rate cuts alone aren't going to rescue the economy or the market, which is reacting to monster losses from mortgages and weakening earnings elsewhere. In order to stop this vicious cycle, we need more than rate cuts that might stimulate the economy in six months or a year. We need economic data today that shows the economy is stabilizing. Washington is looking to bring about that stability with an economic stimulus plan. The Senate Finance Committee heard testimony today that to be effective, any stimulus needs to deliver money to consumers now. Uh, the sooner the better, and uh, the more that can be delivered during uh, the first half of 2008, the better. And uh, the more that's delivered uh, into 2009 and thereafter, the greater the risk is that you're exacerbating uh, fiscal outcomes and exacerbating inflationary pressures. The explosive growth of stock markets in places like India and China in recent years suggested that maybe the world economy had started to decouple itself from dependence on the United States. But the financial earthquakes touched off in market after market because of fears of a U.S. recession indicate that hasn't happened yet. Stock markets like interest rate cuts in part because they tend to depress the value of fixed income investments like bonds making stocks more attractive by comparison. But with a possible recession threatening the earnings prospects of a growing number of companies, Stocks aren't looking that attractive either. Warren Levinson, The Associated Press at the New York Stock Exchange.